There are dangers all around cleaners. Solar panels, rooftop, ladders, supplies, cleaning equipment, aerial equipment, and more. Yeah. Recently, Steve Williams, founder of ISCA, the International Solar Cleaning Academy, introduced his solar panel cleaning safety training courses. But what exactly does that mean? These training courses are centered around recognizing and preventing the dangers and risk associated with solar panel cleaning. I dug a little deeper to find out exactly what the International Solar Cleaning Academy is all about. My name is Chris. For over 10 years, I have experienced just about everything that can happen while cleaning residential and commercial solar panels. Getting stuck on rooftops, ladders falling over, brushes falling off of carports, aerial lifts breaking down, animals under solar arrays, and so much more. Damn, you're good. So far, there are only a few how to start a solar panel cleaning business training programs, but there are no training programs that are designed specifically around the safety of solar panel cleaning. The International Solar Clean Academy has been set up in order to help regulate and improve standards among solar panel cleaners to help uh, set standards so that everybody can be working from the same state safety standards in order to improve their professionalism in their workplace also. One of the primary focuses of ISCA is obviously surrounding safety and solar panel cleaning safety. The solar panel cleaning safety is important because at this time there are no uh, true uh, proper solar panel cleaning training courses. There are of course health and safety training courses which some of the principles apply to solar panel cleaning, those such as working at height and other health and safety training courses. But actually there is no health and safety training course that pertains to um, solar panel cleaning. So this is more of a safety awareness course. We go through the material and through the courses we highlight what the risks are, particularly those of electrocution. And uh, we highlight all of the electrocution points on a solar array and in turn what people can do in order to protect themselves from electrocution, which is obviously the biggest risk as a result of this task. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, roofers have one of the most dangerous jobs in America. The data shows that there are 47.4 roofer deaths per 100,000 workers. Solar systems include many components that conduct electricity. Electricity comes from two sources, the utility company and the solar array because of direct contact with the sun. Even when a building's main breaker is shut off, the PV system will continue to produce power. What are some of the dangers of cleaning solar panels? Thermal burns, muscle, nerve, and tissue damage, falls from a surprise shock, even low light conditions can create sufficient voltage, shocking a worker and causing a fall. The ISCA training program is designed for anybody who's looking to get into solar panel cleaning. Uh, the current window cleaning industry has obviously got an easier step over into the solar panel cleaning industry. So it's designed with window cleaners in mind. And basically anybody who's looking to clean solar panels really should be getting engaged with ISCA to find out what the main risks are as a result of their chosen profession or a profession that they are looking to go into and then also how they can work safely in their workplace and how they can minimize the risks that are inherent as a result of solar panel cleaning. Finally, if you were to take one of the USCA courses, things that you'd be able to understand and learn would be the solar panel cleaning market in your country, the solar panel cleaning market globally to understand the scope and the depth of the industry that you're looking to get engaged in or that you're already engaged in. And then as I mentioned earlier, we're able to identify the main health and safety risks. We explain what a solar panel does, how it works, and we're able to explain how the solar array works um, as a whole. And then we drill into common faults and common defects that you will find along solar panels, and then also break it down into system-wide issues. And then we focus in chiefly on uh, health and safety, which is to do with how we can clean solar panels safely without getting electrocuted. Uh, we look at some of the working at height principles that are involved with the job as well. At the end of the course, there is a short quiz um, and with a decent pass rate on the quiz, you'll be issued certification. So again, that certificate will enable you to approach businesses, and um, particularly the, the commercial sector. You'll be able to approach businesses and say, well, I've done my ESCA training. I've invested in myself. I've invested in the business. You can be guaranteed that if you were to choose us or me as your contractor, then I'll be working in a safe way. 
having full knowledge of the equipment that I'll be working on. Look, you just learned a lot right here in that video, but you still have some questions. That's why you should watch this video right here to learn more about solar panel cleaning.